character and start fresh so ladies and gentlemen this is rune 2 prior to the decapitation edition releasing uh we'll see how it is from now and then maybe check it out again uh once it releases um there's not a ton of customization but i do feel like for what it is it's not horrible you know it's not like bad you do get some really cool like tattoos and stuff that you can put on your guy it's very very uh viking looking which i i i dig a lot like these tattoos are sick let's see no i gotta go with the one that like covers your entire body or upper body at least Some of these I didn't check out last night, but I think I know which one I'm going with. See, that's a little bit too simple. I'm probably gonna go with this one. Entire back done, shoulders, some of his chest, and then his abs as well. Now, then you got a bunch of different hairstyles. Of course, we're going all black hair. Uh, let's turn that tint all the way down. And I think the one that I originally went with, or when I made my test character yesterday was this one um i might go with that as well again but i'm actually going to take a little bit of a closer look this time the one thing i would say is this suit never mind i was going to say the one thing i wish was a way to zoom in your character but uh it looks like this thing up here actually does that for you so I think I'm gonna go with this because that's a very classic uh, hairstyle for a Viking and I think it looks pretty good. Actually, go with this one. Of course, we're gonna go with giant handlebars. Now, do I go with this one? I wonder. Now, I kind of like the shorter style. I think it's a little bit cleaner, especially when you have a uh, like beard part like this underneath now let's hit that move this tint all the way down i think that's a little bit better than the other one um i feel like that's very fitting for the viking character that we're building here and that's it that's pretty much all of the customization but that's okay because there's more weapons and other stuff in the game um, at least from what I played in the first like 10 minutes or so last night. So let's confirm that. Now let's hit normal, confirm character, accept. Let's see how this goes here. I did not watch the beginning uh, cutscene. So I am going to be watching it for the first time right here. And I'll let you know when I, as far as I got when I did test it out last night but uh for the most part I know what happens in the first I'd say like 10 to 15 minutes after that it's all new the to children me of the North here, except for this of Ragnar Jarlson, the fierce warrior who risked all to avenge his father and stop Loki from ending the world peace I will say decades, it did not do this last but night the trickster broke okay. free from the shackles that restrained him and brought chaos to the nine realms and now the end of the world is upon us ragnarok midgard is torn by war oh, shit. storms and the wrath of fierce beasts it was foretold ragnarok would end with loki's death nothing has happened as foretold loki has sealed himself on the vigrid plane to avoid his fate awaken warrior Rise up from the underworld and return to the mortal realm. Do what the gods cannot. End Ragnarok. Let nothing stand in your way. And here we are. Stretch your legs. All right, I'm gonna have to close this out because otherwise it'll keep going to my other mouse or my other monitor. Uh, also, one thing I did have to do yesterday was turn up the look sensitivity a little bit. It's a little bit slow. 
Yeah, that's a lot better. Welcome, mortal, to a land more dead than alive. I am Heimdall, watcher of the gods and guardian of the Bifrost. Your senses do not deceive you. You live again, though at great cost. Mortal, time is, is more it, can precious we actually than you see know, that monster? so pay close attention to my directions. There's a giant, like, beast. Your spirit is new to this body. You are disoriented. Ah, that's why. Move around. Find your balance. Or the no, nearby area. Arm yourself with whatever Very weapon funny. you might find in the vicinity. <laughs> How he runs side to side. It's like a lot faster than normal. Space to jump near. Defeat Archer. You ask how this is possible. Mortal, the last of my power, I will your soul to the depths of hell and bore you across the rainbow bridge to Midgard. Though I have no right to ask, I have nowhere else to turn. Would you help us, mortal? Would you take up the mantle of fate's champion and bring I an will. end to Loki's sacrilege? Will and L. This island was once home to Molten Kelt's clan. You must find a good spot to craft shelter. Somewhere we might discuss your fate. I made that mistake yesterday as a well. Warm hearth is a necessary respite <laughs> for even the hardiest warrior. Chop down five trees. All right, let's hit yeah. this one. I right, use the axe to mine five rocks. The work axe can harvest trees and ore deposit in one hit. Hold E to pick up all nearby materials at one. It's pretty nice. Runes of the old, the honored, and the damned. That notification goes away really fast. Now we need rocks. It's nice that it's a one hit and uh, you're good. Other materials to real rebuild structures. Uh, press and hold E. How's it looking right now? I think it looks okay. And this is this is where it gets interesting. I love the. There's no wait time. Inside the just, structures whoop, whoop, you build, you might find the means to heal like your wounds, cook food, store items, repair. I do see it looks weapons. like it's a little tiny bit laggy. I think I'm gonna turn off RTX. Just think. Oh, never mind. It's not even on. Um, an armor or okay. forge new equipment. We'll leave it Each as is. I mean, it's not like needs. being too bad. It's not like it's delaying or anything. I feel like whatever I just did kind of helped a little bit too. Would E to interact. All weapons and armor have been fully repaired. Open the chest nearby by standing over and interacting with it. Open. And I guess pick up everything. Salvage your old rusty sword and salvage salvaging it refunds raw materials. So old rusty sword is this one. And double click. Create a hammer. Take the hammer of wood, I guess. I guess. And craft items using recipes you discover through leveling up or exploration in the world. Recipes consume the ingredients and may require a crafting nearby crafting station. The campfire can be used to cook more fulfill, filling meals out of ingredients such as meat and mushrooms. An anvil may be required to craft weapons and armor with improved damage and defense. Uh, some of them may be that. Together while hovering over the item or to salvage it. Okay. So now rebuild the seer hut. <laughs> Sturdy hut. Though you know not of your past, it is clear you have not forgotten your talents. <laughs> this is as I had hoped. It is not by chance that I selected you. It is not by chance. In life, you were a loyal Jarl who died not in battle, but of the plague. Damn, An sorry. unbefitting fate for a thane such as yourself. You belong yeah. in Valhalla, not else frozen yeah. underworld. I feel like this would be a really Do fun game worry, to play mortal. with friends. In time, I will help you fill in the blanks of your past. But for now, we must focus on preparing you for the journey ahead. I, Heimdall, will be your guide. 
Heimdall. There is someone Heimdall. here that I want you to meet. Warrior right. reborn. I Talk am half down. Seer of Wotenkeld. Ah, brother. Oh, what's left of it? Thank you for rebuilding this sacred domicile. I sense you are charged with points of Asgardian energy. A gift from Heimdall. Perhaps you should look within and see which of your tributes you wish to enhance with this energy. All right, various activities like completing quests, reading lore store stones, and defeating enemies grant experience. When enough experience is earned, you will level up, granting you attribute points to spend. Attribute points may be spent in a character detail screens in order to improve the four primary attributes, strength, dexterity, wisdom, constitution. Each of these primary attributes influences several related secondary attributes like health, attack, damage, and stamina. Some equipment and status effects may modify these attributes. Leveling up it will also unlock new recipes for more advanced equipment and You items. must allocate these points evenly. So then we go into here. And so from my understanding, yeah, like God power, it doesn't really explain 100% what some of this stuff is. But, uh, like, obviously, stamina is pretty cool. So I probably have, like, three, three, four, three, and we'll do four. Four, three, four, five, three. Ah. <laughs> that way we kind of have a evil, or even playing field. Um... And also the God Power, Berserk Time and God Power, I haven't really learned yet. Ah, oh, we have skills here as well. Oh, we have one skill point. I did not look at this yesterday. That's pretty cool. Um, This is pretty much as far as I got too. Like there's, I know there's some people that are about to attack, uh, but that's it. That's all I did. I was like, okay, I'll check this out tomorrow because it was kind of late, but I, uh, so what exactly do we have right here? We have one skill point available. Uh, next level blessing, reduce stamina use by 20%. Bloodlust gain 10% critical when you are bloodlusted. Okay. Increase your health regeneration by five times for four seconds. That's kind of cool. Screaming a rage, staggering and dealing 50 damage to enemies in the tenemir cone in front of you. That's kind of cool. So then what is this? Oh, is this like um, worship Odin? Worship Thor? Worship a god? And worship hell? That's pretty cool. Damn, yeah. I didn't realize that they had like this kind of stuff. Vampire attack. Melee attack will restore 5% of hell. Not be staggered or knocked down. Is it just worship a god? Uh huh. Smite, hammer throw, charge weapon. Damn, dude, some of these are sick. Odin, Odin's and kindness. Flock of raven, ravens surround you. All right, these are pretty neat. Uh, huh. Summon bear. Ally calls upon Odin's wolves to add, aid you in combat. Does one of these have one as well? Raise dead. Reinforcements, summon a mercenary to aid you in combat. That's pretty cool. I think I would either go with uh L. Cause then you can you're kinda like necromancy. But then also having this one is pretty sick too. Like chain lightning, hammer throw, ball lightning, smite, arched weapon. And this one's like a lot of arrows and like it's neat. Really cool stuff. Level three is required for that one. These probably all these are required for three. Yeah. Level six, eight, ten. Sweet. Um mm -hmm. reduce stamina by twenty percent. I feel like that's actually would be really useful too. Staggering enemies, dealing fifty damage to enemies in a ten millimeter cone around you. Hmm. 
It's so difficult. All right, let's go with Sonic Blast. Right click to learn. Ah, there we go. Okay, cool. To raise all the faculties equally, or channel several points into one area to specialize, it is your choice. As you reach new levels of experience, you will be rewarded yet more points of Asgardian energy. Do not forget to assign them to your tributes each time you level up. Choose wisely, as energy assigned cannot be returned. <gasps> when you are satisfied with your statistical improvements, a seafaring vessel recently ran aground not far from here. Please, investigate. I fear your arrival may have revealed this sanctuary to the world. Go we'll find out. Uh, combat maneuvers include light attacks and heavy attacks, blocking and dodging. Uh, light attacks can be blocked by right click and space or dodge. Initiating a block consumes stamina and prevents his regeneration. Blocking before you're about to be hit with a normal attack causes a parry, leveling your enemy vulnerable to attack, or leaving your enemy vul vulnerable to attack. Heavy attacks, ah. So left control are slower and consume stamina, but do more damage. Heavy attacks break through blocks and parries. They can also be dodged to avoid damage. More damage indicated with the yellow sword icon. Critical hit chance may be increased using a better weapon, armor, and dexterity points. Some attacks may break blocks and are indicated with red hammer icon. And you have elemental status. And we pretty much get it for the most part. So tab to cycle on targets. I did notice that the enemies, they attack you like pretty darn fast. And... Not bad. There it is. Have fallen under Loki's sway. Slaves taste treacherous designs. I had a lot more issues the first time around. Runes are powerful consumed items, consumable items. Use them to give yourself an edge in combat. Find throughout the world to, or craft yourself using a rune forge. Rune of health uh, activates bloodlust. Teleports the user forward a short distance. Currency for fast traveling in Midgard. Different runes can be crafted at rune forges. Only Yo, what's going on, Ben? Loki's thrills prove useful. Hello, my friend. When their bodies fall, <laughs> so too may useful items. So, what happened to the skill that I equipped? Oh, uh, drag to hotbar. Ah. Now return to Halfden and tell him what happened here. There it is. Prepare your defenses. A horde of enemies approach. Thrall. <sighs> I suspected as much. Defend yourself Some have not the from will the to resist Loki's enchantments. Enemy. Others might if they tried, but choose to serve the traitor anyway. My advice, slay them all. Let hell sort them out. I believe the men you encountered were but scouts. Ah! When they do not report back, more will follow. Indeed. I sense them approaching now. He staggered. Warrior, prepare yourself. Defend this structure. Boom. Hordes of enemies may attack settlements while arriving in raves. Hordes will try to destroy buildings, kill villagers, and demolish the central statue. One second. Uh, if structures are damaged or destroyed, they must be repaired before they can be used again. Many vill villagers will respawn in the world after some time if they are killed. Uh, if the statue is destroyed, the horde event will fail. Okay, good. Th good thing there's not a friendly fire. We got a few pieces of equipment here. Bury defenses, a horde. Enemies approaches. Ah! Got him. Uh oh, I think they're attacking the statue. I don't like. 
like how slow this thing is. The axe that I used yesterday did no damage, but it was a lot faster. You handled sure. that horde admirably. Perhaps when oh. all is said and done, the deeds of your second life will be enough to earn you a place in Valhalla after all. Mortal, Loki <laughs> gifted this island to the Draugr warrior Harim, but the land belonged already to old Wotenkeld. Go to the stone that marks the battle between Harim and Clan Wotenkeld. What happened? It just started raining for like three seconds. And then it stopped. You're safe inside buildings, your health will slowly regenerate. Is this like a okay it is. Okay, uh Did I equip these. Wait, so how does equipping work? Oh. Oh, you have them equipped already. That's why there's a little icon. I see, I see. Got it. Uh, cool, cool. Crafting, campfire, hunting spear. Uh, is there anything else we can craft or able to? Spear, weapons, consumables, armor. Leather harness, campfire. Build this to place in place to warm yourself. Okay. Well, if that's the case, then uh should be fine. Let's see, you can cook food in here, you're safe inside buildings, your health will slowly replenish, and you can use useful items. Vaults. Okay. Let's see if I can actually do some cooked meat. How many is there a place that you can like wizard too? Yum yum yum. <laughs> and okay, so you can probably move some of those. Oh, that's a bandage. Cool. Some of this other stuff we can probably get rid of. So like maybe this work axe since we have two of them right sharp and sharp get rid of that repair equipment cool all right seek the binding stone at the center of the island so i did not do this part at all you to toggle between throwing a weapon or a grenade. This one's mine. Huh. Interesting. Yeah. All right, that's kind of cool. I'm into this. Got a shield. Stone axe. Cool, cool. Will you find a rune stone or won't you? Question. I guess we should probably keep heading towards the center. So these give you, okay, so a lot of those lore objects give you, looks like recipes for items and then also some lore, which is neat. First year of Ragnarok. Rhyme slew many of old Wotan Kelt's people until the wily chief bound the Draugr with sacred stones, but his presence still taints the land. I would see this island set free, destroy the three binding stones, and slay Harim as he awakens. I will. We need to destroy three stones. Leather hand wrap offers. No. 
human leg. What are we? Brian was a Jotun captain who cursed Aegir whilst pissing from the bow of his longboat. Aegir drowned Harim for that affront. In death, Hell recruited Harim and gave him to work. Aye, that's kind of cool. Nagelfin, a ship of nails. Come on. Slow reaction time of this can be a little bit rough at times. Oh, just master. Yet a rhyme I like how easily it. everything breaks. He sailed Nagelfar to Midgard. The Queen of Death's entire Rogar army crowded upon its decks. That's good. But once he arrived, he pledged loyalty to Loki instead. This island of that betrayer, and you may earn something to carry you across the sea. I will. A vessel to have you serve upon those freezing waters. Not bad. I think this game would be a, a lot of Behold, fun. Behold, Harim, the betrayer. You are my hand. Kill Strike him down. Where? Where is he? Break the center binding and defeat Harim the Disgraced. Harim! Oh, I thought you were bigger than this. Ah! Wait, take this one. Ah! Oh, slow of durability. Which you take. Hey, so? Mortal, it appears Harim has dropped something of value. Claim it. Harim's great sword. Let me just pull out this human leg. <laughs> Return to the seer. Why would they equip that in, as your uh, main thing? Here it is. Let's throw that in right now. Oh, wait, legendary. Legendary weapon? <laughs> what? Okay. Put a lizard in here. Let's throw that right there. We can take this out. Okay. Now we've got a great sword. We'll take some of these. We'll probably have some things that we can actually craft now. Or a few more, at least. How was your day bad? What'd you do today? Anything fun? Oh my god, dude. 30 minutes in and we've been killed by a tree knocked down twice now. <laughs> it's so bad. Oh no. What happened? Dude. My thanks, warrior reborn. Rotten Cold is finally free of Herm and safe from Loki's all seeing eye. 
For now. For now. I would invite you to stay to recuperate from your resurrection. But I fear Heimdall has immediate need of you. Once you leave, <laughs> I will That's ask true. Heimdall Did you just wake to enchant this place again. You will not be able to return. But know that you have my gratitude and my prayers. Uh, Goodbye, I worked today. Warrior it's okay. But... And may the free gods be with you. Yes, Mortal. sir. When you defeated Harim, you gained scraps of his seafaring wisdom. Use this knowledge to construct a raft to carry you over the darkened waters. I Dark shall show you waters. where to place the boat. Very well. I will do as you ask. Go to the crafting thing. Okay. Oh, that's nice. It actually shows you what you can make. An axe. I uh, don't know. Highly likely to break. Rock. Let's make a raft now. And then we could get Radiant Soul. Heals all allies in a 10 meter. For that. Or we could wait until we hit level 3 to unlock some of that. So... I think I'm gonna take Berserk, cause that seems pretty cool. And then do I like drop it in here, I guess? Yeah. Okay, so some of these are, ah, I see. These are special abilities. And then the other ones are, um, this is like a bloodlust ability and then you have blessings as well. Okay, cool. Nord knew the tragedies of Ragnarok better than most. Nord's go to a map. Discover new locations and artifacts using the map. Reveal more areas by exploring and sailing through them. The legend will describe what each symbol means. Misery was built by the farmer as he watched his farmlands drown. Your seaward journey begins there. Oh, wait. Before we head there, let me repair all equipment. That'll be helpful. And then also, let's see. Wait, so accept tribute. Oh, thanks. Thanks for the bandage, my guy. Uh, okay. And then can we actually make any armor? We can make a leather waist bar, uh, waist guard. What does this require? Leather scraps. Can we make any of those? destroy that for another one of these okay i think we have one forging and basic crafting other scraps is hide okay so we can't make the next thing but it's not horrible i guess and uh didn't i just get something all metal and now we can make leather braces. Does he on automatically equip the other thing? Oh, he did. That's why. So hands, back, and torso. We don't have anything on yet. Harness. We need one more for that. Okay, that's fine. I'm sure, we'll be able to find some eventually. All right, we're back out onto the uh, into the wild. I guess if we see any, like, yep. Sorry, dude. Animal blood, and did we get anything else? Do you get like hide or anything from them? Oh, God. Oof. Again? Or is that bloodlust? I think that was bloodlust, actually. Yeah. Bandage. <laughs> I love how the bodies go flying around. Oh, okay. Open your inventory. Nice. We unlocked the wooden bow. Mushrooms. Okay. 
Yeah, that looked like something you could pick up. So open your raft in the I menu. The raft, uh, place the raft in your radial menu. Hold the mouse button. Place the left raft in that location. Okay. So let's move it right here and take this and that. And then middle click and then release. Aha. I'll set sail for the place I have marked on your map. Sail. Goodbye, island. Damn. <laughs> That's a pretty cool way to start out. I would fast travel, or it, it loads the next area. Pretty neat. Most people you encounter during Ragnarok are unlikely to be friendly. Be on your guard. Like in real life. It's pretty neat so far. It makes me want to play uh, Assassin's Creed Valhalla, which I'm very jealous because it looks like some people are getting early access just like the uh, Watch Dogs Legion. My hype is starting to build up a little bit for that game, so I'm looking forward to it. Ah. <sighs> Oh god. What is going on right now? Oh boy. What is happening? Why is it such like white area like this? The last screen was all black. This time it's what the? That's a starting area. <laughs> Right. Okay. Whoa. Oh, nice. Age of Awakening. Begin your adventure and Welcome introduce yourself. Welcome to Midgain, mortal. As promised, I have carried you across the Vivyaka. Bifrost to the center of Midgard, Vivyaka. where my watchtower stands. Though I may communicate with you at times and offer guidance. Loki's curse prevents all Aesir and Vanir from stepping foot in Midgard. You will need human allies. Ah, so are they like my this ally now? This is Vivica, a seer Vivica. loyal to our cause. She will assist in our retrieval of the Gjallarhorn. Are you, are you coming with me? Welcome, warrior. I am Vivica, seer of Midhaim. Servant of the free gods and leader of the mortal remnants the name given to those of us who remain loyal to the deities who oppose Loki Heimdall spoke of your coming Take this hunting oh, spear. Did he? If you are to be our savior, I would hope you already know how to fend for yourself Oh, yeah Meet with blacksmith Yulner when you're done there come find me at the remnant village to the west Okay I like how it tells you the, the area number. That's pretty neat. I don't think that'll work. Ah. Scroll and nice. We rebuilt that. Meet dark leather. Nice. It's neat how you can run around and like craft stuff and like uh, make buildings so easily for the most part. So now, which one's better? Uh, this guy or the other one? Sure. Uh oh. Ah. Uh. 
Got him. Forgot we can make a bow now. Wait. Who is this guy attacking? I think he's he's either hunting or he's trying to come after me and surrender whoa oh no got a bow Ooh. we slice them right in half damn dude Again, some frame rate drops here. Okay. Nice. Got some uh, elite armor from that. It's a little back and forth, not gonna lie. Uh, but it's not too bad. As far as frame rate drops, I could always drop the uh, quality. Me, but... Whoa, leave him be. He didn't do anything. Uh, don't even bother trying to block his lunges. Just dodge him. Oh, God. Ah. Thanks for your assist, stranger. Get away. Dude, I'm still in combat. Do with sense with the charity cases. Just look at your setup. Get some protection, shall we? As I'm sure you already know, most weapons of armor can only be crafted at an anvil. That bandit drops some materials, like try crafting a leather harness. Ah. Uh. For the most part, it's probably easier to, to fight without being in a locked on mode. The essentials craft a leather harness for protection. Oh, yeah. Well, other scraps. Nice. That iron. What? Do I really need a leather harness? I mean, I found this piece of armor. Defense Elite Dark Leather Armor. Pretty sick. Okay. I don't... I, I highly doubt that a leather harness is better than what I currently have on. Talk to the blacksmith to show him your progress. Say, warrior, this isn't half bad. White fur mantle. I'm running around naked, right? Here, take these materials. Might come in handy for crafting more protection. Okay, nice. Uh, well, let's actually break this down now. And break down the rusty sword. So, do I... My back piece I don't have done yet. Stone axe. Do we... No, we didn't get a bow, but we do have some arrows which is neat there's bronze that we could make is there anything that i have that like requires bronze hunting spear yeah not really, at least. Okay, that's all right for now. Do we level up yet? We have one attribute point to spend. Spend it on this. Okay, so the bottom right is your uh, XP bar as well. <laughs> Game save, nice. Yeah. 
sure that will be useful. Oh god. Uh oh. Uh oh. Uh oh. I'm stuck. How do I get out? I'm stuck. Is there a stuck man? Let's see. I'm literally stuck. I'm stuck inside. I can see this being the one problem of, uh, why is that? 